in the mood, I'm in the mood to check this out. I just want to know if it works. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut a small piece out of this clear sheet. is a check, check, check. All right. Next, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab. I think I can use this one, but not all of you have that one. So I'm gonna use this one that's in the kit too. Just gonna see how this works. Yep, there comes a little dot. All right, so that works perfectly. Now, the meaning is of this, you have rhinestones. And these rhinestones, like I said, this is an old hobby of mine. These becomes the gray one on the back. You see that? You see the gray on the back? That means there is a a layer on that so if you are going to make these hot with your iron then this will stick on whatever surface you are going to add it now i'm going to use this with glue but you also can put this on your clothes so that's that's cool okay i'm gonna open this up Let's see which ones i'm gonna use Come, baby, with the wing. Oh, this one is also nice. Okay. Alright, so now these, of course, are not for this one. So I'm going to put this away in my basket. These three. Nice. Blue and crystal. I'm just going to see which ones because they are different sizes I'm just gonna test this out guys I'm just gonna test this out all right so as you can see we have to be honest it's pretty lightning but you will see that there are dots on here. So these are also dots, not too good to see, but we can manage that. We can manage that. So I'm just gonna start on a few here on the belly. Just put a few little dots on here do not put too many on one time now you can use a um a pin set for that and you can push that on the white spot perhaps you have oh Perhaps you always, you also have, um, yeah, I use sometimes a picker. A picker. Um, let's see if I have it. Can't find it right away. Need to check that out, or where that is. But a pin set will do the trick too. All right. 
right, one more in this row. Cool. Right, that looks pretty much cool. That's cool. And when it's dry, I hope it stays on, on there. <laughs> But it's a try out, it's a try out guys. It's a try out to see how good this works. Now these, these crystals, they are a little bigger, but perhaps they are nice for the tail. So then the blue one and then I'm gonna mix here some purple. I'm just gonna try to see a little of the matching things that I can use. Perhaps one little crystal for the eye, but I'm not sure where my pickle is. Where is it? And it's just a sticky thing that I also had with my diamond painting. Where is it? Right, I'm gonna search for that. It's a little bit easier. Okay, I'm gonna use my my just a little zoom in so you can see them way better. I'm gonna use my picker, my sticky picker that I use with my diamond painting. What you also can use is um, is um, is oh my gosh the it, perhaps you have an eye pencil a white eye pencil that works too that works too guys i use that too in the past just a white eye pencil Let's see what this works amazing Just put these on. And so on and so on. Just do every time a little. Not too much. so much in the past I did big pictures small ones t-shirts jeans cool push them in the glue on this place. Cool. Alright. Um, yeah, there is some blue ones. Shall I do first the blue ones? I don't know if that is handy. Oh. we have the purple ones too but here is just light so perhaps but these are a little bigger hmm I was not sure these are a little bit bigger here on the belly so that means that we have to search a way to let these fit all right just gonna continuing. 
doing sales first some and even you use one color that's also good of course that's good too do some blue here too just just continuing with the blue Just testing this out, guys. I have no clue if this will stay. <laughs> so perhaps it does not work on this clear sheet, but I'm just gonna try. I think it will. This good clue, so must. It must work. Okay, this looks nice. See what I mean when this is lighter? Perhaps it's nice to do. But these are not the same size. That is not good for me. Why do I not have the same size? Hmm, right. Well, it's okay. It's okay. Now here are also the blue ones, right here, but I think it's better to do right away with, with, with the color that you prefer using, what do you say? What do you say? So I'm going to use this piece. right handed so I'm just going to use this and I am going to use the big ones Ooh, let's see how that work out see now I have a little gap right there that I can fill in with a blue one yeah that looks ah that looks good I want another another little piece. Make sure you do this step by step the brick way. See so now I have a little gap right there too where it fits a blue one yes oh that's so cool 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 all right i think i'm gonna what shall we do shall we do one layer more I want to use the purple. Mm, here you can do some purple. Let's do some purple.
cool. See? And this goes on and on and on. So you can use your stones, whatever you like. I'm going to use the tail now first. Before I don't see it any longer. <laughs> Gosh, I like it. All right. I'm going to take a zip of my drink that I don't have. <laughs> I see. So I'm going to take a drink and then I'll come back to you. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see. Perhaps it's not the brightest idea to do first the tail, but you know me. You know me. I'm not the brightest. Oh yeah, and then she was quiet. <laughs> she can be quiet. She can. Not much, but <laughs> sometimes she can. Especially when this is pretty much Not difficult, but you just follow a bit the line right here. See how it ends. Take a double. Push this into the glue. Let it dry. Hmm. Okay. Oh, this shimmers a lot. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna turn on this on white handed so. Do some purple. I know you don't like fast forward, but gosh, oh, this is so nice to do. I like it. Something else. It's definitely something else to do.
just follow a bit the colors and then everything will be right. Just use your fingers. And let's do another piece. Alright, pick one up. You don't have to do this. If this is in your kit and you say, oh wow, that is not my thing, then just skip it of course. Can you imagine how diamond painting, how much, oh my gosh, that was so much work. But it's finished, it's finished, yeah, we need to find a place where I can hang it up. And then I'm going to show you how that one turns out. It looks amazing. But gosh, that was a lot of time. Why I, I could have put my basket. Why I did not use that. All right, just not thought of that earlier. Make sure you push the stones into the glue. Love it. Love it. Alright. I think we do. We can do some more purple. Shall I do a bit? For myself, or do you want to stay with me? I know I asked that so many times, and you always say hey, you don't want to pass forward. Don't, don't do that. <laughs> well, the choice is always yours, of course. You can skip everything you like. So far, so good. Perhaps it was better to do the tail also with a dark color. Mm. No. I like how this turns out. Alright. Um, let's see. What? Shall I do one more? No. I'm just going to continue in first with purple. It's definitely a good advice to keep this pin in. Keep the pin in. It is. Keep the pin in. The glue is not, not that quick dry, but do not go make a cup of coffee and then come back. Because then I think the glue is dry. And I think when this is dry and it's... It's working out nice. Then I think you can cut this out and you have a nice embellishment where you can glue it on on every surface you want. I think. See how quick that goes actually? That goes pretty quick. Now here there is some blue. I don't want to miss that. So 
So this is actually a little round blue piece. Yep. And then a few blue. Cool. All right. Oh, well, now is a big piece of purple right here. Till here. So I'm gonna do a little piece of my own. <laughs> you know the drills. I'm gonna come back in just a sec. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Let's see. I think there is, I want somewhere, a nice eye. Where? Is this a good fit for an eye? I think it is. I think it is on this dark blue spot. I'm gonna use a nice crystal. Yes! Alright, let's continue. Alright, this is blue. I see that. See how that turns out. Yes, I think one more. Yep. Alright, so let's go back to the blue. Close it, otherwise it gets stuck. And blue. Okay guys, we need a few more blues. It's not that hard, it's just filling up every little spot with the stones. Especially when my girl was little, oh I made so many t-shirts for her, so nice to do. Brings all back my memories. <laughs> all right. Let's do the heads. I'm gonna first do the blue. I think I want. 
want this around with blue. Check it out. Bring on the blue stones. This is actually really relaxing me. And I know the diamond painting did that too. They even asked me if I want to do another one, but uh, 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 no, 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 no. If I start on something like that, I just can't quit. And how much I do like it to do it, but my back is killing me to sit hours and hours to do these stones. And this is not diamond painting guys, I know, but it's quite the same, quite the same. All right, so let's go back in here. For some purple. Guys, we're almost there. We are, we are almost there. time did I did this? I don't know. I did just one little spot of my own without you. Just a little spot. The rest I filmed. And then let's see, am I with my head in the way? I have no idea. If I am, <laughs> I'm so sorry. This one definitely needs another one. The snout of a seahorse is not that sharp. Yes. Ooh. What do you think, guys? And now it's only a matter of do you like it or do you need to fill something in. I don't know how does a seahorse look like. Let's grab one. Yeah, this one he has this piece right here. Yeah. Hmm. Alright. Yeah, that I like better. 
another. Alright, just what do you say? Do you like this? It's so cool. I do like it. What do you say? Shall I do a little purple? Just a little. I don't know if, if that's necessary. I don't know. Is that a good idea? Bad idea? Let's add a few. I think that's a good idea. Just a few here and there. I think it does. All right. Now the purple ones are a slightly smaller than the blue ones. So I think the purple ones are easier. See every time and I did not close it. I absolutely hope not that these stones are going to get loose after they dry. Let's pray for God. Because I absolutely love this little seahorse. How it turns out. So I hope not that it will get loose. And like I said, it's a test. It's a test for me. And if it gets loose, then I just need to figure out another way to use To use these stones. Okay, I think this does it. Gives the tail just a little bit more. Hello, here is my tail. What do you say? This is better, doesn't it? Yes, this is way better. I like it. So I'm gonna let this dry overnight, and then tomorrow I will see 
if it's working or not. Cool. Yeah! <laughs> All right. Um, if you want to add something more, then you just can. Because this one, wait just a sec. This one right here just seems a little odd. It needs a little more, I think. Let's add a bit blue. See? That's a bit better. Do I want it a little rounder? Then just add a few two, I think. Oh yes, this is definitely better. See, it's rounder. Yep. Nice. I think I'm gonna stop right now. If I keep adding, 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 adding. Yeah, I like it. Yep, I'm gonna stop. Yes, thank you so much for watching me and this long. I hope this it will stay on. So, yeah, I'm gonna. Put these back in the bag as good as I can because perhaps I'm going to use these on the front cover with the words. I know I did last year using the crystals for um, for using the words. Um, I'm not going to show you. <laughs> yeah, oh wait, these are mixed. Alright, so, yeah! So these you can still use because there are a grey layer on. You can still use these on your fabric. Just use an iron. And I know there is some tape also. We can use it for, but that I don't have anymore. Alright! I will stop now. Bye-bye. Hey guys, it's the day after and I'm gonna see how this turns out. Because I don't want to tell you things that does not work. So if I try something, I let you see how and if I like it or not. But this is how it turns out. Alright, see, now you can see the back. Cool. Alright, so this is pretty good. Now, I don't know if it's a good idea to cut these out, but you can make a nice pocket out of this. So it's a little better than just glue this on. What do you say? I think I'm going to make a little pocket out of it. I think that's a good idea. But I do love it. Absolutely love it. Cool. So, yeah, now I use three colors of the stones, but if you do like this, but um, perhaps you like one color a blue, one color purple. It's totally up to you how you fill this in. So you have this template and you can just make a nice seahorse with it. Cool. And you can make more, of course. You have lots of stones left in the package. All right, so yes, that was a success. I'm gonna make a little pocket out of this to make it a little nicer. All right, stay tuned for that. Okay, now let's say I'm gonna make that little pocket on top of this one. So 
that means that we are going to <coughs> cough first. <laughs> All right, let's see. Well, this I think will do, but we need to unwrap it. So I'm just going to grab a new piece of paper and I'm, I'm going to do this the scrap queen way, guys. So I'm just going to grab a piece of paper. Okay. Then I'm going to score half inch. And yeah, of course, this is way too large, but let's just see how it goes. I don't have to use the full sheet. All right, one inch down. Now, let's say I just want to see a little edge. So you don't want to waste all that paper. Okay. Let's make another score line. Now I'm going to cut this off half inch. All right. And fold it. All right. Open this up and make another half inch. going to cut this angle off so we don't have any bulk. Alright, branch this down. Halfway there guys. Alright, so this is already nice. See, now I do see that little edge of the this paper all the way around, just a little one. All right, so now I'm going to see how high this is needed to be. Well, um, um, wait just a minute because I do want that half inch here, just like this. That means that my just attached to that and I want it here. Alright, so you can measure that of the wall. Alright. There we go. Fold this, uh, cut this down again, half inch, and again cut this off. You don't need that. Fold it down. Now, let's see. Yep. So if I now cut half inch out, then I hope it just fits. I hope it does. So here is my half inch and where is my other half inch? Otherwise I'll make the border just a little bigger. This is a half inch. Yes. and. That one, so it's tricky, it just fits with this border, but it does, it does fit. So I can cut this around half inch all the way around. All right, um, I'm gonna use my hammer ruler. I love that one. Easy to use. So first I'm going to make the marks where the half inch goes. And then I can
I just love to make first some of the drawings and then check it out if I'm good. If you don't have a hammer roller, then you need several marks, of course, of a half inch, and then you can be straight too. All right, so this is how it looks like, and again, I'm gonna check it out if it fits. Oh my gosh, it does, but it's small, and it's my fault because I didn't make this um, this clear sheet too large so that's my fault of that but I wasn't sure what I'm gonna do with that so but it's it's possible it's possible but it's tricky it's tricky it's tricky it's tricky it's tricky <laughs> all right so I'm gonna cut it out Let's see what happens just see what happens Just follow the lines. Here we go. Oh, this one was a little off. Okay, so this is my window, and this is coming on the back, of course. Just gonna do this on the other way well so I don't see my marks. Yep, that's better. thing that I'm gonna do first is what shall we do we can use tape we can do that but I like paper I like papers papers which one do we want actually I want a dark one do we have a dark one I know we have a blue one. This I want to like. Alright, so first things first, I'm going to cut this. The correct size. Oh wait, perhaps it's nicer to do this this way. Wait, 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 stop the press, stop the press. I'm going to do it this way. This is better. Let's cut this first a bit better. Yes, alright. Make new marks. Just can be 
a little shorter. I don't want to miss my white edge. Yep, this is way better. This is way better. Now, I'm going to flip this over. I'm going to make just going to make a line with my pencil. There we go. And now I'm going to cut this. I'm going to cut this a little shorter on the inside because I want on the other side too a white edge. Okay. So I'm cutting this all the way around. So I'm going to cut around that pencil mark. So the frame is going to be a little smaller, so we have that white edge. Okay. Let's see. Don't throw this away, you can still use it. Cool. It. Yep, this way is it. Yeah, cool. I love it. Alright, now first I am going to attach this little piece. Nope, that's not true. I'm going to open this up. Uh, I'm going to grab my little one here. And I think I need to cut it down just a little shorter. some double-sided tape to put it on or well, you can use any any double-sided tape but I still have this one so I'm going to use it now because of that edge that small edge I'm not going to make this too large otherwise it's going to stick so I'm going to stay inside here So if you're going to make this, then make sure that your up and bottom piece of your clear sheet is a little larger than I did. Alright, I'm going to peel this off and then I'm going to make my arc little glue with just a little tiny piece. Just a little tiny, so it's still attached, but not with tape, just a little edge. And that's possible with art little glue, so that is why I love the art little glue. Now I don't know which size my frame was, just checking. Check it out, yep, this way, this way. Alright, let's glue it on. I'm gonna be aware of my little piece. My little edges. Now first burnish down the tape. Hey girl. Hi. Hi. What are you doing? I'm recording. Yes, I am. 
testing something out. Oh my god. Oh! Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Cute. Oh yeah. Cool. That is cool. Cool that. Mm -hmm. What do you want? Okay, so this piece up, I'm gonna glue it down. So nothing is going to stuck stick stuck. This just overlaps that little piece. Cool. Yes. All right. So, yeah, for the rest is ready. We can push this on. Is it still this way? Does not matter, but I want to have that white edge. Yes, it's this way. It's still cool. There we go. Put some glue on. Paper so it becomes one with the white. Cool. What do you say? All right, that is cool. Cool, cool, cool. Now let's say. See, this is already bumping. I don't want this. This is better. How does this look? I think it's cute. What do you say? Alright. Let's add it on. Seahorse. Cool. Love it. Yep, and the rest is still working, but oh my god. Yeah, and now you can make a nice tag in here. Let's use the same size as the blue one. A little smaller. So it will fit nice in the pocket. And it's not dry yet, of course, but... This is always the thing. That's that's the, the hinge right here. So I'm just not going to make it any deeper. You don't have to. But put 
clean it up. Yep. All right, so it's up to you how large you want this. I'm just gonna make it this size, I think. Yep. I just love making this one. course we are going to decorate this and put something nice in here and decorate this cool yep I love it I'm gonna let this dry because I always like to work a bit with this but I'm gonna let this dry there let this dry let this dry I have no patience you know that So my opening is just a little, yeah, cool. Yes, all right, that's that guys. That's it, that's it for this page. This page is pretty much done, except for the decoration of the tags. We're gonna do that perhaps in a sec, perhaps the next page, who knows. I like to do my tags with the leftover pieces right here. So if I have more, and don't forget to use these, then I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. What's in this tag? Let's see. Oh wow. Well, it's enough embellishments, this, this place that you can. We will use that later. All right, so yeah, finish it up. Finish it up. Yes, I will. <laughs> All right, thank you so much for watching. Till the next page. I was saying that earlier, but then I was get lost with my stones. Cool. We have so much to use. You can also use these words somewhere. These are cutouts, I believe, not stickers. What are these? Yes, you can cut these out. I love these. So long a time ago that I made these. Fishy, life, thankful, blessed, sand, shell, ocean. Which one do we like? Um, I'm just gonna cut the first line off. Just a sweetie. Alright, I'm gonna use this, I think. These are just too cute. Cute, cute, cute. I'll leave this for the next section. Girl, this takes way really too long. I know. I'm sorry, this takes way too long. Alright. Oh my gosh, I love it. Do you see that? Oh my gosh. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Go, 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 you spoil me. Alright. I'm going to glue this down. And 
some white. There we go. And this way we can use a nice embellishment on the bottom or at the top, wherever you like it. You can put it here, but I like it here. Yes, all right, Diane, stop with this page. You keep going and going and going. Yes, but this is why I like having the black coming back once in a while. All right. Cool. Yes, all right. I will stop and go to the back of this page. Yes, I am. <laughs>